all right guys welcome back to the channel so as you can see today uh i got new grills for the car so yeah these are the uh, these are some gloss black ones and as you can see right now the ones that i have are chrome and um uh, yeah uh i'm trying to go for the blacked out look for my car so i think this will look pretty good man so as you can see that's a mock-up of what it's gonna look like when we're done all right guys so what we're gonna do first um we're gonna install these top pieces on it first because my girl actually it's in, in two uh it has two uh two sides to it so as you can see up here there are some screws that hold in this chrome part right here and we're gonna take those off first all right guys so uh this is what it's supposed to look like once you're done so as you can see you took all three of the bolts out and that's the piece that you're taking out right there. Take the bolts off right there. Then um, you're gonna grab the, the the side that fits that part of the car, and you're gonna put it on just like this. Make sure the holes line up. And there you go. It's in. And now, now that it's in, you go over here, and you're gonna put those all those screws that you just took out. You're gonna put them back in. And now, once you're done with this, uh, you see right here, put all the three bolts back in. We're gonna go back here, and it shouldn't move. Uh, also guys, make sure when you put this in, do not put these in too tight, because they will crack uh, this right here, the little part that you just put in, because this is plastic. So uh, yeah, just be mindful of that. And uh, so once you're done with this side, go ahead and do the same uh, thing on this side. And uh, yeah, just take off the three bolts and repeat the same exact thing that you guys just did. All right, now all three bolts are off. One, two, three. We're just gonna take this piece off like that. Set it down. And you're gonna put your new piece back in. All right. Just like that. And there you go. And there's little tabs right there, so make sure you line them up right. And it'll go in pretty easy. All right, guys, so now it's going to be time for the lower section of the grill. So now it's going to be these two right here. And this one is going to be a little bit more tricky. Um, and that is because to reach uh, the tabs to pull these out right here, you need to undo uh, some bolts that are in the bumper. So you have one, two, three, four bolts that you need to take off. And then uh, you have to reach in here and you need to pull the tabs. So uh, you can actually see on your new grill that's gonna, that you got. Well, yeah uh you can see the tabs that you're supposed to pull out so you can use these as a reference uh to see uh where you're supposed to like push down so you can take off uh this grill right here and uh yeah so let's get to it all right guys so these bolts right here these are going to take a t30 so just put that in there and then uh yeah start loosening them up man All right, guys, now that you got all four of your bolts off, one, two, three, four, uh, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull the bumper back, and then you're gonna see right here that there are little tabs right here that you're supposed to pull down on or pull up, and uh, that'll actually get your grill to pop off. So you see that right there, that's one, there's more. So there's two right here, and then two at the bottom. Uh, once you get those off, you're able to pop your old grill back in and then yeah you should be good i'll show you guys when i'm done all right guys so the old grill is also actually my bad there's actually three clips one two three and uh yeah you just push up from the bottom like that and release the clip and that's how they come out uh so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna install the new grill so you can actually see a before and after all right guys so this is actually gonna be the easy part uh installing this is really easy actually so uh, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna put it in here, gonna line it up with the uh, with the old hole. So you can see there's old holes right here for where the old one used to go in, and then you're just gonna put it right in, just like this. You know, snap it into place. Make sure it snaps on all sides, and there you go. That is done right there. And look at that. That is already looking pretty good, man. 
I never liked the chrome on these. I think they look really plain. I don't like chrome on my car. So I'm going for that blacked out look. So these are actually looking pretty good. So yeah. All right, guys, now that we're done with this side, it's going to be the same exact thing over on this side right here. But I actually got an idea. I think I'm going to put the old chrome piece back up here so, so you guys can actually see it before and after. So it's going to take a little time, but hey, man, I'm trying to I'm trying to give you a good comparison. All right, guys, so I already put, uh, put the old piece back in and look, that's the before. So look at that the chrome on there. And that's the after. I really like how this is turning out. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna get right on it. I'm gonna install this side and uh, I'll show you guys the the final result. All right guys, so as you can see, I got the grill installed. You'll see it's not going anywhere. So now the only thing we need to do is put these bolts back on and then uh, yeah, I'll give you a final look. And that's the final look, guys. Uh, tell me you guys what you think. Uh, I think it looks pretty damn good. Not gonna lie. Uh, it's way better than these pieces of junk that used to be on it. I don't like cream at all. So, yeah. Uh, let me know what you guys think. And, yeah, stay tuned for more videos, guys. All right, guys. So, if you liked the video, uh, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. You know, do what you gotta do. Uh, yeah, guys. Uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know if you like the car. Let me know what else you might uh, want to see that uh due to the car also you know i might have another video coming up soon about the mods that i already have done to the car um and yeah guys uh i bought these girls off of ebay i don't think they were too expensive they were around um i think they were around like 30 bucks not too bad honestly uh and yeah it really changes the look of the car i really like the way it looks and yeah it's a cheap mod that you can do i mean anyone can do this you know as long as you have the tools for it and um yeah guys so let me know if you like it and let me know what i should do next you know uh i like to hear your input and yeah guys uh see you next time